Hello, and welcome to the 1.1 update for best services, The Score by SanuScore. We got a lot of feedback from users who loved this library and immediately started to work on new features and stories. In this video, we show you the major changes that come with the 1.1 update. First, we couldn't stop creating stories and offer 10 more stories for you, so we now have 132. We'll play some of the new stories for you later in this video. Let's now take a look at our new features. Key switches can now be transposed by one or two octaves. Just go to the settings page and change the position of the key switches to make them fit to your keyboard. On the shape page, you can now load an instrument for multiple times into multiple slots. This can be helpful to design more complex and specific patterns or notes within the sound of one instrument. Let's do this with the grand piano in the customizer. As you can see, it's now possible to load the already loaded grand piano into another slot. Let's move to the play page and copy the piano pattern into the new piano slot. Now let's do some changes on the pattern. As you can hear, many exciting musical patterns can be realized with this. Let your creativity run wild and try programming your own little Chopin etude. There's a new clear function on the play page for single slots. This new function makes it easier for you to edit your slots, especially when you need to silence a slot for a new key switch. No need to drag down all steps manually anymore. Just go to the slot and select Clear, and the selected slot will no longer play anything. Chord Studio. To our great pleasure, the Chord Studio has been particularly well received by our users. This is also where most of the suggestions for improvement were made, and we listened carefully. As requested by many of you, we have prepared 16 new chord types that allow for more advanced harmonies. Let's listen to a few of them. Another thing that you've requested is available now. With the octave function, you can adapt your chords not only using different inversions, but even more precisely to the structure of the arrangement. If you want to create a better note flow in a chord progression, the best way to do this is to match the different inversions with the octave function. If you want to keep the root note of the chord during an inversion, you can easily do this by selecting the chord's root note as a bass note. This allows you to create the smoothest progressions, even with more complex chords. Timeline. We've now filled the respective timelines with suitable chord progressions for all stories. This way, if you want to try out a new story, you can listen directly to how our story creator had imagined it. Let's listen to one of them. But be careful. Always remember that all stories are very versatile and can often develop a completely new mood if you change the chord progression yourself. Another great user idea was to create a chord generator which generates chord progressions to get some inspiration. When you switch to scale mode, you'll now find a cube icon. Select a scale and a root note and click on the cube. A chord progression is automatically generated with every click in your timeline, with basic chords matching the scale and root note. If you found a nice chord progression or created one yourself, you can also lock it in with the lock icon and listen to it with the other stories. By the way, did you know that we also included individual chord selections to play with in our jam mode? Try it out, have fun, change the chords if you like. Composing is all about jamming and experimenting. For the lead NKI, sustained instruments are now available for the slots. 
Using sustain, you can play melodies as in the legato, but furthermore play polyphonic material. As a special gift for you, we've created 10 more stories, all marked new in their names to make them easier for you to find. Let's play through a few of them. That was an overview of all the new features and new content in the 1.1 update of the score. And the best thing is, the update comes free for all existing users. To download your copy of the update, just visit the user area of bestservice.com or click the link in the video description below and go and follow the instructions on the site. This has been Frank from SanuScore, and I'll see you next time.